Welcome everybody to the visual arts in the built environment. As many of you know, it's probably the most unique architectural visual arts program anywhere in the world, certainly in North America. And the fact that it's a dual degree program where you receive an architecture degree, an undergraduate architecture degree and an undergraduate visual arts degree. So um, I, my name is Jason Grassi. I'm the coordinator of the VABE program. I'm an architect. Um, and I'm also a composer, and I teach in, I think, almost all areas within SOCA except for film. So I teach in uh, music, or visual arts, but of course, primarily in architecture. And I am the coordinator of the VAVE program, meaning that if you have questions about the program, or if there's something you're not understanding, or if there's conflicts that you're having between the two schools, I'm your point of contact. So any questions you have at all regarding course, uh, requirements or scheduling or the typical problem of, you know, I'm not seeing something and I register for the class or I'm having problems getting into the class, you need to see me. Um, so email me anytime if you have those, uh, those sort of problems or concerns or anything like that. Um, and you can do that anytime. VABE is a unique program in the fact that it's very small size classes. And with it being so intimate that way, I'm able to know exactly what each student's uh, issues are, um, what makes each of you tick, and uh, whether you're having a good day or a bad day. So there's that immediate point of contact, which we have in VABE, which is really necessary because of the um, slight intricacies of the program. So you can contact me anytime if you have questions. So with that introduction, I'm going to talk about courses that you will be required to take in your first semester of your first year in VABE. Um, this is only for the first semester. For anybody who wants a general understanding, I'm gonna go through that with you right now. Um, the first uh, semester and second semester of VABE are actually quite similar. And um, in terms of what courses you take, because we would start with Architecture Design 1 in first semester and in second semester, Architecture Design 2 and so on. So the first term, in VABE, uh, the courses that you would take, I'm just going to go through them right now so that you uh, clearly know what they are. Um, these are, they're all required courses. The first year and the second year of VABE is, is very structured because you are getting two degrees. And so with that, um, it's important that we give you a course sequence that works without conflict. So there are times where we can adjust things, but that would be on an individual basis where I would speak with each of you. But for the most part, for the first two years, courses are required. And in the third year is where you have many of options for electives. So the first course I'm gonna talk about is Contemporary Visual Culture. Um, it's in our Media Arts and Culture series of classes. This is more of a lecture class and the course code for it is MACS 1500. <clears throat> the second class is your key core architecture class. And this is a really interesting class because it's broken up into two separate studios. So you'll register for Architecture Design 1, which the course code is VABE 1100, but it's actually two courses together, okay? And you, once you register for VABE 1100, you'll automatically be put into those two classes. It's an architecture studio and a visual arts studio that are combined. So you'll be in one studio, you'll be in architecture, another studio, you will be in visual arts, but they are considered one class. It's a double weighted class, meaning that it's a six credit class and not a three credit class. The other classes I'll be showing you in this list that you need to sign up for are all three credit. This is the one double weighted class, which is six credits. Introduction to Architecture One is a, exactly what it sounds like. It's a very broad class, lecture-based class, um, discussing key issues related to what architecture is, how the profession works, uh, what to expect in the profession. It will discuss key architectural buildings uh, of all dates. It will talk about ethical concerns related to the practice, um, what it's like to be an architect. It goes into those sort of issues. This class is actually taken at our, at our um, combined other school, the University of Detroit Mercy. So you will be taking this class over there and you would be introduced to the faculty over at University of Detroit Mercy with this class. You will sign up for it at Windsor as VABE 1190, and you will automatically as a first year student 
be enrolled into this course at the University of Detroit by virtue of just simply being accepted to your Windsor. So you don't necessarily need, you don't need to sign up for this class for this semester on the Detroit side. This class is a drawing class. It's a studio practice and ideas. It's a drawing studio. Um, so this is in the visual arts component and you would sign up for it as DSAR 1070. And then this is a class which is not within the School of Creative Arts. This is uh, Access to Differential Calculus. Many students ask, well, I've had calculus in high school, will this transfer? And the simple answer to that is no. This is a calculus class that you need to take at the university level. It isn't that much more challenging if you've had calculus in high school. It's actually very close to the same level of difficulty. Uh, the issue is that this class will transfer from University of Windsor to University of Detroit, which is required later on for your classes in structural engineering, which you would take in the fourth year at University of Detroit Mercy. Um, so this class you would take here at the Windsor side, and uh, this is math 1780. Now, uh, it's important to know that in this first semester and in the second semester, all courses will be taken at Windsor except for the introduction to architecture. In the second semester, you'll have the same sort of sequence. You'll have intro to architecture two, and that will be the only other architecture class that you take in the first year at Detroit. So there's your suite of classes for the first semester. Again, if any of you have any questions, feel free to contact me anytime. And I look forward to seeing all of you in the fall. Thanks, bye-bye.